Communicating with your users via email is an important part of the application workflow. Backendless supports several events which may automatically trigger an email message. For instance, an email may go out when a user registers with an application, logs in for the first time, or requests password change. The application developer can easily customize the text of the emails as well as the user identity used to send the messages. To change the email text, log in to Backendless Console, select your application, and navigate to Users and then Email Templates. Select an event from the drop down list. The title of the message sent, when the event occurs, can be entered in this field. The text of the message itself goes into this field. There are several substitution variables supported by Backendless. You can use them in the subject line and the body of the email messages. Backendless will automatically replace the variables with the actual value when it sends out an email message. You can send out a text message to see what the email looks like by using the Preview button. If you do not want an email to go out to your users for a particular event, use the Do Not Send Email for the Event checkbox. When Backendless sends out an email, it uses the configuration settings from the App Settings screen, located under Manage. The settings include the mail server host name, port, and the user account, which will be used to send email messages. In addition to the predefined events, the Backendless API supports programmatic email delivery. That means you can send out email messages directly from your code. This is supported in all client APIs provided by Backendless. This concludes the overview of the email setup in Backendless. Thank you, and endlessly happy coding!